be STJ and Wizzy. I don't know if those are reward levels or if they're just happening no matter what. Uh, but today is the last day, I believe, or the second to last day. Probably the last day. Go check, though. Uh, so you can sign up and have it only be 20 bucks instead of 30. St. Nicholas hopping on Mike. I'm back. Hi, how you doing? Good. How's your break? How's my how's my what? How was your break? Friend? Oh, my break was wonderful. My ears got a rest, <laughs> uh, so I'm absolutely delighted. And let's see if I can pull my chair. Hey. Okay. All right, Briggs starting out strong. I was commenting that I wasn't sure how he was going to do after some sloppiness against Peanut, but... Cover also does not consider himself super strong at this matchup. Okay. Uh, I don't know if he thinks that, like, Marth Lee's is stuff out or something, but he's uh, definitely doesn't feel great about it. Yeah, and I mean, I, that makes sense. But I don't think there's any Falcons in their region either, right? Um, I mean, no, there are Falcons. They're just, like, probably not very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, just... Yeah. Which is also a problem we face here, although Briggs getting kind of good now, so. Yeah. Listen, Us. I'm all about a Falcon getting good at MPVA. I think we could definitely use the experience. Um, yeah. So, yeah, I'm not Maybe about it. Wizzy Zane sets won't take three hours. Yeah, no, that would be super cool. Um, I mean, I, I don't think anybody plays Falcon like Wizzy. Um, and I mean that in a way that, like, I'm both amazed and terrified by it. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't like to watch it, but I respect him for doing it a whole ton. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I just, I, th I think the tech chasing, it's just like one of those things where it's like, wow, how does somebody not figure that out before? Because he's just fast chic. Yeah. Yeah. Um, he's just chic, but people really romanticize his fair um, in a way it's very troublesome. Uh, <laughs> but anyway, yeah, look, I mean, the Briggs doing a little bit of that reactive tech chasing himself. Um, oh, no. Like oh, but Kavar capitalizing off of these opportunities. Yeah, they're going to take that stock wow. from him when he was in a bad position. Wow. But listen, the sign of a good player is one who can just really reverse those situations so quickly. Yeah, that was some great decision making. And now he's just got him stuck in a corner and putting a lot of aerial pressure. I like the Brig, like, he very hesitantly trying to make it back, having his back to Kavar the entire time, probably trying yeah. to get, like, a bear or something. Uh, and goes deep for it. Wow. Oh, yeah, he's still alive, okay. Okay. I spoke too soon. He's that, not still alive. <laughs> yeah, the Nair, but I, th I mean, that Nair was like such a weak hit, which I feel like probably wasn't what Calvar was intending. Yeah. Um. I say, Calvar does this thing sometimes where he just kind of stands still under or on a platform. He's He makes... I and don't want to like, say that he's lazy, but like there's there's a certain effortless it's laziness. It's just like a type of like K-On type... <laughs> Oh, I, yeah. th I think Kaon's in a league of his own. Oh, Kaon's um, definitely in a league of his own in his cheesiness, but that's okay because Kaon Lucky is the best Fox Ditto that's ever happened. Where did that happen? Uh, one of the Southern tournaments. I can't remember, but it's my... Listen, Kaon's had some amazing performances, has some amazing performances in his time. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, no, I love how Calvar will just stand yeah. still and wait for people to do stuff and then react to whatever their very dumb option is. Um, because, you know, you don't need to move around all the time to intimidate your opponent. Yeah, and I mean, like, a lot of melee is forcing people to approach you and, like, waiting for them to approach you. And if you stand still, like, for some reason, people are more likely to do it than if you're threatening with dash chance. Yeah, that's real. Oh, love that. Oh, so oh nice. Uh, nice mobility from Brig to get around it, but then didn't matter. It's time that he does it again. <laughs> um, yeah, it's like, I feel like if we time that forward stash maybe a little bit differently, we'd be in a different situation. But um, either way, a very, very patient recovery, too, which is another thing that I really enjoy about watching Calvary's play. I feel like there's so many situations where I'm like, well, there's, there's no way he's going to make it back from <laughs> this one. And then he does, and I'm like, oh, yeah. sick. I just don't have a competitor's mindset. Um, just give right. up on that stock. It's over. Yeah, cool, cool aerial cover trying with the air dodge, which I think actually worked out for him because it put him in a position where he could, you know, just try Get recovery him. all over yeah. again. Great forward smash. And wow, this is looking way more dominant than last game. I, like, didn't notice because they were both hitting each other a bunch, but... Yeah. Calvar still has all his stocks. <laughs> yep. Well, and of course, as soon as you say that, you curse yeah. the poor man. You know what? Um, I'm kind of glad. Four stocks are not fun at this point in bracket. Yeah, <laughs> that's real. Well, I mean, they're fun for me. I directly benefit from Calvar doing well, but that's neither, yeah. here. That's neither yeah. here nor there. Uh, okay, cool side B, but you're not that cool of a guy. Um... All right, the rolling spot dodges. Oh, he thinks he's dreffing. 
<laughs> okay, that dare was just like far too high. I mean, I guess it like did kind of like threaten aerial space. Standing still in the corner, bites him a little bit there. All right, nice. Good job keeping him off the ledge. Oh, okay. Oh, I like no. what the brick was doing yeah. there, kind of. Like, I think he had the right idea. It's just, like, that's not exactly what I would do. I like how he, like, stretches his neck back in, like, regret. <laughs> um, but, yeah, he's trying to make up. He's yeah, trying I to mean, make up for the stocks. I think the lost. grab was the right option, too. He just needed to dash first and then... All right, cool. I like how he's moving around Calvary, too. Okay. Calvary, like, did the up tilt way too late. Like, tried another option that just blatantly didn't hit that high up. And I was like, oh, wait, up tilt? Oh, yeah, that <laughs> works. But by that point, it's too late. Oh uh, no, Brig! I. Uh, that is like simultaneously so punishable and so not punishable. Yeah, I, I hate, that move. hate it when I see it. Uh, Reverse. A nice. lot of time from Brig at weeklies. Although he's come back from what was almost a four stock and made it look very doable. So yeah, that was. Very you know what? Okay, cool. Do all the side B's you want in neutral, and I'll. <laughs> if you win this set, I'll never comment on it again. Yeah. Actually, either way, I guess I won't because I'm moving. But. <laughs> uh. Okay. I'm just gonna wait out the cool. transformation. Yeah. You know, I was saying on commentary earlier. I mean, I think they should just play it out. This is foolish. Either way, he should not have gone within perfect forward smashing range. I think that was. Not that yeah, great. he's kind of. Oh, okay. All right, called the right idea, but. All right, I like the down tilt, but that's just not gonna hit at this percent. I think nice. Brig also looking much smoother with his uh, wave dashes or ledge dashes. <gasps> oh no. The brig is looking so smooth with his tech skill. Uh, he's yeah. really just knocking every ledge dash just out of the park. Um, <laughs> Hack dashes, on the other hand, go straight off stage and to the pit. Very impressive. Cool. Doesn't seem to be a fun, a good stage to recover, but this is Brick's counter pick, right? Yeah, I mean, well. He did just almost come back from a four stock. Yeah, that's true. Like, <laughs> he had momentum for quite a while. I think it's kind of the right choice based on how that ended. But. Okay, good block on the dash, dash attack, or the get up attack. Good cover. Yeah. Pretty clean punish right there. Yeah, no, I'm like, no, I'm liking this punish game. I think he's capitalizing well. No messing around. Great, yeah, because see, now he's using the up tilt to, and like spacing it to really get like the strongest that he can. Yeah. Okay, I'd like cool. to see Calvar do some, or Calvar, I'd like to see the Brig do some slide off DI trying to counterpoint that or uh, SDI in tech, but that's hard. That's it. <laughs> oh, okay. I wonder if he was going for like a pivot or something. Uh, nice, nice. I like how he's just snaking around him. Gets the grab, carries him across the stage. Oh, I think that side view is a. I don't really agree with that choice, but. <gasps> okay, all right. Two very. 2001 melee. Try out all the moves. Yeah. Don't know if they work. Go yeah, on. why not use them? You know, I don't. I don't know what a Z drop is. I have no <laughs> idea. It's yeah. But down B, Falcon's down B is great, guys. Falcon's down B really. Kicks rules. across the whole stage. What are you gonna do about that? Yeah, you know what we don't talk about enough is Zelda's bear. That's really the best move in the game, and you know, no two ways about it. Mario, top of my tier list, hands down. No, Zelda's top tier character in the game. Two knees and a shine. Two knees and a shine. What else? Are you, what are you gonna do to that? Yeah. Yeah, no. Marth just, you know, is just chained to the stage every time I I jump with him. He just falls right back down. Oh. Lovely. Great oh. stuff. Finally getting the spacing that he wants. Yeah. Spacing he craves. Nice. Okay, yeah, back throw is exactly what I want to see. But again, just doing that a little too fast, a little too eager. Nice. Open up for the break, but he doesn't get anything off the knockdown. And okay. You just kind of see comparatively where their punish games are at. Yeah, no kidding. Like, Kavlar's goes either Calvar. from 0 to 50. Yeah, sorry, Kavlar. Goes either from 0 to 50 or 50 to death. The bridge just kind of gets openings and then does 